like it works better than this because this gets so fat and hello hello everyone <laughs> we have a bunch of things to tell you um probably gonna you're gonna do the um as soon as we get a few people in here you're gonna talk about the paint oh i i i guess i should yeah i hadn't even thought about it. i was just gonna ask you if it was that way for you but but i will i'll talk about the blues anyway yeah um i haven't gotten them out because i didn't i didn't I don't know that I got that deep blue, or maybe I did go get it. And well, the deep blue was the one that you said Lisa said to get this one, so I got this, and then I oh, found yeah. these. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. So you had them in the same video, you just didn't ever put them next to each other. Yeah, I probably didn't. So no, I will pull them. I will. I will pull them out though, so that I can look at them and see, because um, I'm pretty sure they probably are the same. Um, yeah. I'm going to get a brush and I'm going to, I'm going to try them again to see, but I, okay. they're, it's, if they're not the same, they're so close, it would be really hard to know Yeah, uh -huh. if there's a difference. Okay. I got to find me a bottle of what, I mean, jar of water first. Okay. Hi, Sana. We're, I had to clean up my mess. I had such a big old mess that I, I just, it just was bad. <laughs> so, oh. Hi, Sana. I'm so glad you're here. Um, let me get out those paints because I put them away. This one is. Uh oh, uh oh. Okay. Uh huh. Nope. Hmm. I lost it to the Never Never Land. You lost what to the Never Never Land? The blue paint. <laughs> oh yeah it, it fell you know it, it just it fell i have i have uh kind of a mess in my cupboard and i need to do something about it oh i wonder I'm 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 here. I just am, am digging in my cupboard. <laughs> dig away, dig away. Yeah, well, it's not helping matters any. Hello, gang. Welcome, welcome. Hi, everybody. I'm gonna there compare these two soon in just a second here. Um, this is the deep blue that they had at Dollar Tree for a long time, and this is the new slate blue that was with the Thanksgiving or fall stuff. There is like maybe a minute difference. Okay, not guess a, what? Not enough, I think. Yeah. Okay, you're gonna go big. Um, guess what? I didn't get the deep blue. What I got oh. was phthalo blue. Okay. So that's why they they didn't look. So... Oh. I got, no, I've got cobalt blue. I don't have a phthalo blue. Yeah, this phthalo blue is new too. Oh, no, I need to find that. They didn't have. This was the only blue that they had, you know, in the uh, other section. Regular, you know? Yeah, this was this was the, a new blue that they had in their regular paint section. Okay. So that's well, there's why a difference I between that. There's not a difference between the deep and the. I and mean, the there slate. might be a little bit. We're gonna we're gonna check it out, but I was gonna say this slate blue is really dark. Yeah. So, um, why don't you make yourself big so that they can? Well, I don't. And you know what? I need to go to uh, uh, Facebook and um, tell everybody we're on your channel. Okay. I'll I'll be right back. All right. I'm gonna put a little bit of this slate blue out, and then a little bit of the deep blue out over here. And it's not going to show up a whole lot in my camera. Maybe if I, once I get some blue on here, it'll show up better than when it was just a dot on the white. Okay. Okay. 
Let me find my water. Rinse this out. Hi, Teresa. Oh, it's nice to be back to play. Yeah, um, except that for some unknown reason, my channels are not working. Let me go on my phone. It will it will be easier on my phone. Oh. I'm just guys. I'm just trying to tell everybody that we're here. So. Um, Okay, and this okay. is the deep blue. Yep. And now I'm going to let it sit, let them both dry, and then we'll see if there's a difference. I think this one is just slightly grayer. Uh -huh. But it is it is so very slightly different um, that I'm not sure it matters that much. Well, see, and that's it. Um, hi, Teresa. Hi, Brittany. Hi, Sana. Um, that's hi, the Brittany. Thing. Teresa. I'm just glad I'm, here. I'm off spreading my word, spreading the word, guys. Um, okay. It's not that way. Um, okay. We'll see. They both look sapphire to Teresa, yeah. Yeah, that's it. Um when this one gets dry, I, I don't have my I don't have a place to plug in my heat gun yet, so uh, okay. Um, okay, I just posted on Facebook that we were live, just in case people are, it's not telling them. This phalo blue, though, is, oh, you can't see me. Oh, no, let I'm me put you up. Go. Oh, Teresa showed off her new beads. Yay. Um, this, fa fa the phalo blue is considerably lighter than the darker blue, than the slate. Yeah, blue. it does look like it. Um, so, um, it's, you know, it, it's definitely a different color than the, the cobalt, um, it's it's got a, di a different hue to it for some reason. I don't know exactly why, but it is. Um, we'll have to try to watch later, uh, Teresa. I have been covered up. Um, I haven't. I I'm haven't. gonna bring this back out in a little bit, but I think you, the, this one is just a little bit more gray. Yeah. A little less blue, but but it is very slight. Mm -hmm. um, if I was going to choose one or the other, I, I think I like the slate blue the best of the two. But, yeah. Um, but they are so very close. I don't think that it's, if you have one, if you have the deep blue, you could just add a tinge of black and it'd probably look like this. Yes, that's it. Um, I'm going to just get these out because I want to mention them. Um, what Lisa's showing off is Dollar Tree has these new things that are coming out with their, hi, Sharon, um, with their holiday hi, stuff. Sharon. And I'm going to tell you something. Jeff took me uh, Dollar Tree shopping yesterday. I had to go to several stores per Tuesday for mom. I had to go three stores to get something. The, the same thing I had bought last week in one of the other stores. But it took three stores to find what I wanted. And not all of them have these. Um, if they do get them, they get one box. And it has six colors. And from the looks of the box, it would have six sets. These are colors that are not in their regular line. Um, Lisa, you said you, you only got the four. Yeah. I got. Um, she couldn't get the pumpkin and the this green, and these are both gorgeous colors. Right. Yeah, the pumpkin and the green were the one, ones I really wanted, and the slate blue, yeah. but I didn't get the pumpkin or the green. Um. Anyway, but only one store even had them out yet. So I'm going to go back today and see if the other stores have got them out because if you don't get them at the beginning, you probably won't find them. Right. Um, I'm also going to tell you that yesterday in our Dollar Tree shopping haul, because I went after, okay, I needed two more of these, right? I needed two more of these. 
I bought six when I found them, but we didn't find them until I had been in, I think we have seven stores in our town. And I did three stores Tuesday. No, we must have eight stores in our town because we did five stores yesterday. Wow. And um, Pisco is pretty good size. And I had two things on my list. Okay, actually three things. I had these, which they're magnetic, and I showed these off last night. Um, but when I got them, they have four colors in the box that they come in. And again, these were in the uh, school supply stuff. So our stores are running out of school supply stuff. They're almost gone. So yeah, um, yeah. that's, uh, but I wanted just the turquoise and purple ones. I didn't want the other colors. So I, and um, so I, I bought them all over town because not everybody's got them. And they've sold out a lot of the stores that my biggest store didn't have any of them. Um, but they're magnetic. And I had this idea when I got them home and I can get seven of them up the side of my spinning rack. And so um, just going to put a piece of metal up the sides of my spinning rack. And um, then I'm going to use these. So I wanted a bunch more. And um, then I needed those two clear tubs. Hi, and Nicola. I am not Glad kidding. I, I, it was the eighth store we went to finally um, that had them. I could get clear lids, I could get clear bases, but I couldn't get any clear boxes. But in the process, and I am going to do a, a video, they have, this is fall. They also have a set of Halloween colors. Oh, oh really? Well, the Halloween yes. colors weren't in my stores either. Right. So, but Halloween, a lot of the stores are just putting out the Halloween yeah. So um, that is probably going to be better. Um, but these are colors that are going to be come. They're going to come and they're going to go. My guess is as soon as they start putting out Christmas stuff, you need to start looking for a Christmas stuff. Yeah. Um, now, like Lisa said, the slate blue and that really deep blue that she had was um, colors that they've had that are very close. But these other five colors are not even anywhere close to the other things they had. Hi, Nicola. So that is true. Um, and these are six ounce. These are the same kind of paint as is in those other bottles, like this one. And I really like these. Uh, I happen to like them on the jelly plate. They're thinner and they squish out and they don't dry as fast, but they have a fun texture. I like I like the texture in these. So yeah. Um, anyways, I just I want to tell you that if you want these or you need to look for them right away. Now, one of the things I will tell you is that sometimes the smaller stores that you don't go to all the time have some things because people like me don't like to shop in them because they're smaller and they don't have everything. So, yeah, that's, um, that's, yeah, find that's them big stores it might be worth going to the small ones to see. yeah it's worth going to the smaller ones because i'm i'm pretty sure i got the halloween ones the other day at the tiny store but that tiny store is always such oh it's you have to walk over stuff it's terrible it's just a horrible horrible store so um and i have to go make jeffrey um turn the air conditioning down i'll be back in just a minute all righty um I'm drenching. <laughs> yeah, I did that right before we went on. <laughs> Only room in the house that doesn't have a ceiling fan is this dining room where I decided I was going to start doing my stuff. Yeah, do one, and if it's not enough, I'll have you do another. Whew. Yeah, 101, yeah, just 101 outside. Well, we're having a cool down this minute. Week. I didn't put my hand here. Like there. 98. It's what? I said we're having a cool down this week. It's only going to get up to 98 today. Um, yesterday at like 8:30 in the morning, our heat index was 117. So it's it's just awful. Okay, guys. Um. Well, it's hot here, but I'd rather be here than there. 
Yeah, I, because the humidity is just ridiculous. We're not getting yeah. rain, but it's the humidity is horrible. Um, I hope I haven't missed anybody coming in, but remember if Ah oh, Barbara, hi. Um, but last Sunday we were talking about doing this project and what we did was we got out some of the the cardstock big cardstock that we don't like. <laughs> or yep. like I just one, I just cut mine up. <laughs> yeah. Like this one, it's never going to be usable for me. You know, really and truly it's not. So um some of these are just the the images are just too big or uh, that's that's really what these are. I don't like these. <laughs> yeah, I, I think they're ugly. So you know something like that that you okay, do not really use. That's fine. Okay. All right. Um. So we're gonna do that. But what we're gonna do is oh I forgot to tell you the other um Dollar Tree thing. What we're gonna do is we're kind of gonna make our own Nomad book, but we're gonna make it little and four by six. Because if you cut this sheet of paper up, it makes a four by six card and or four by six page. So um, that's what we're planning on doing is making four by six pages. Now, my other Dollar Tree thing, since we were talking about this and Lisa has that paint to show you. Um, I in our Dollar Tree shopping extravaganza yesterday and um jeff ran into somebody and offered to go get her a cart because she had her arms full she said no i can't have a cart because i'll fill it up and jeff said my my wife's been in five stores and she's filled this cart up every time but um <laughs> oh dear okay you'll have to let us know what's going on barbara yes we'll keep her in our prayers yes ma'am anyways you know the section of Dollar Tree that has the three dollar and five dollar stuff. Yeah. Okay. They have all that craft stuff in that section. Yeah. Okay. I was also on the lookout for the Dollar Tree um, resin, and I, there's no store in town that has it. Not a single store. They have all kinds of the inclusions. They have uh, the forms. They have all kinds of resin stuff. But they don't have the resin and after i did that resin with the the christmas stuff the other day i really wanted to play with it a little more and i have some good stuff but i wanted to try out the dollar tree stuff they don't have it the deal is when i talked to one of the new uh, managers <laughs> so she could hold still for 30 minutes uh yeah especially if she's doing an mri in that silly tube um but the um that section that craft section with the three dollar and five dollar stuff they're eliminating ah okay um they that's where those big bottles of pouring paint are isn't it in that three dollar yes. section it the big bottles yeah. of pouring paint are in that three dollar section um so what's there is there they will not be getting any more um Oh, people just use that. the dollar 25 section and say forget it for the three dollar section well that's it the thing of it is is that the dollar 25 section makes them a lot of money the the three and five dollar section does not and it takes up a lot of square footage and square footage in a retail business is what makes a difference and yeah. apparently so they're getting rid of the three dollar and five dollar sections all together or just the craft? no just the craft stuff out of that section and what they're okay. going to do is expand the holiday section now if you didn't notice there's a lot of halloween and fall stuff yeah. in that section right now well, what's going to happen is the the craft stuff in that section is going to go away and the halloween stuff is going to expand or the christmas stuff is going to expand okay um so they're not doing they're not doing away with their dollar 25 craft section because that makes the money um it's the it's the three and five dollar section so but you're right that pouring paint is in that section yeah i saw tons of that yesterday it was like everywhere i went they had a ton of it and yeah. i haven't bought any of it but um i have some i just haven't used it yet yeah so well, i wanted to show people this is our inspiration for what go we're bigger working on so today because i'm just going to cut stuff go bigger so okay. they can see yeah 
Um, so I'm going to show you some of the pages I've done in here. Most of you, um, most of you've seen a lot of this, but here I just, I added her and I added this couple. The rest of the page was already there. Excuse me just a minute. Well, Teresa, yeah. we're going to be praying about that too. Uh, I'm just hoping everything goes okay. Oh goodness. Yes, we sure will be. Sorry to interrupt you, but I want no, to No, that's fine. Thank you. I added these guys in. Uh, there's a lot of pages in here that I haven't done anything to yet. And then this one, I added this, and it already had the drops on the, the little hedgehog. So I just added them and had them coming out of this faucet. Um, so... <laughs> I kind of put things that don't really belong together together is kind of what I do. Um, just things that make me smile or whatever. <laughs> I was gonna say, it's, a, it's a whole lot. It's all about making me happy. That's yeah. Mm -hmm. So okay, let's find some more that I've actually worked on. I added her, and then I added these flowers. That's all I've added to that one so far. But we were talking about it would be fun to do the same kind of thing with a smaller format. And in this one, I added, you know, all of this. It was just this. And um, the rocks were here and the rope was here. And I added them into this one. What happened oh. was, is I had out my tiny, tiny, tiny composition books, and, uh, oh, I like that one. That's fun. Yeah, that's one of my favorite ones. Anyway, we're going to, we're wanting to make something like this in a smaller format. Right. I just lost my glue. Because <laughs> I, had, I had out my, um, well, you, the other thing is, is you had started to make a, uh, another book with, yeah, know, with and it's like it. this. Yeah. But I was adding um pages in to make my own book like this but then they do were doing this they're, and i didn't cracking. like that so we were talking about that while she was talking about her little book and so we decided that we would take and i'll get out one of my little books in a minute we would take uh the idea do it on a single sheet and then bind it with the single sheet binding later so, we chose this size because it was the size of the little book. Yes. The little composition book. If you open that up, it's basically this size. Right. So you see my little composition book is just like that. And if you put this on the top of it, it's just a little bit smaller. But it will work really well. And you can cut up um, uh, 12 by 12 paper 12 by 12 <laughs> paper for it but also index cards come four by six if you if you want yeah. to just do it on an index card you could do the same project on an index card and i have to cut up paper or not have to have paper that you cut up but both of us have a ton of and this is cardstock it's not just yeah. paperweight it's card this is cardstock too it's stuff i don't really care about wouldn't probably use um, but I wanted to show you some ideas of places to get images. Yeah. Um, you can get them from calendars and I don't have that example here, but, um, but you can find them in magazines. See, this one would be, um, fun. You could either put it like right here and you could add something in there or you could do it here and add a little something. I kind of like the person being in there to give perspective mm -hmm. and um, and just taking it out there so you could add some animals or whatever. Um, and then here's one that's just rocks. So you could add, you know, whatever you want into that. This would that be was fun. my drawer, not me. Oh, Hi, Joyce. Something. Hi, Joyce. I'm glad you're here. Um, 
so there are all kinds of you know things you could get and you can also find um images in here you know in magazines to cut out and put on top of your backgrounds um i also had this um yukon railway i was getting all the kids school stuff put up and or <laughs> thrown away mostly <laughs> and we had this huge bunch of alaska stuff because we did an alaska unit study for ethan's first grade year and um so i have all these kinds of things that you know are possibilities and then i saw this one card and i thought oh well we could cut those out cut individual flowers out and you know glue them onto a background and then i saw this one and thought okay you could use that card as a background oh uh-huh yeah so you yep. have to look at everything um now it's not you know it you would take off some of it um to do this but i think i did one with that image and put a um giraffe in there but i can't remember what book that was if that was the nomad huh. book or i don't or remember but else. anyway i just thought that was interesting that that was a card um and i had seen that before Mm -hmm. And I think I'd played with it before, but anyway, and now I've got, I've got a book here of, uh, you know, birds and bird nests. So you could, you know, cut out these probably wouldn't, they're too small to be back. Well, I guess, you know, we could put backgrounds in there, but it wouldn't be as easy to, do, but to up, add in I something up, like that would be fun. Yeah. I, I cut out a bunch of, I cut out some birds to add into things. Yeah. Um, so and um and you can look at books like this it's just a gardening book but you could add um you know you could add little creatures into this background you could find little animals or something to go in the chairs you know you can find um different things i'm, I'm wanting to do a bunch of different kinds of backgrounds so that i can have a variety of things to choose from well and i just i you know i pull images out of magazines when we're on the trip i, I that's one of my go-to um evening chores is yeah. the is to disassemble magazines well um i have boxes of those images and i just went through one of my boxes and pulled out a bunch of magazine images that i think will be big enough so um, that that's my plan. I found this at the thrift store just the other day. I haven't actually looked at it. I'm not going to use it for this project, but I just wanted to see. Oh yeah, it's pretty. It's one of those. Hi Sherry. Um, Dover clip yeah, those, art books, mm -hmm. where they show you what it is, but then you're supposed to print them out yourself. You right. Know? But I just mm -hmm. used the book. Yeah. Anyway. I got that while I was there. Yeah, whether or not that CD would even work in a new computer. That's the next question. Yeah. I don't know. I don't think we even have a computer that has an option to use one anymore. Oh, you don't have a CD drive on something? Um, see, that's one of the reasons my my that I have as big a computer as I have is because um, I have to have a CD drive. Yeah, well, we do have one on our big um desktop computer desktop. Mm -hmm. it's just not being used at the moment i had one in yeah. my last laptop but it adds a couple hundred bucks to the price of your laptop yep. so i didn't get it, it this time. sure does especially if they write instead of just read yeah so but um of course this the laptop i have right now is for work so you know I had to have it had to have a lot of storage it had to have a whole lot of things so so you could choose a portion of this i need to make me a okay what i'm finder. doing well, hi kel what i'm doing that's right what now you're doing is making, making a viewfinder it's making a viewfinder what i did yeah. was is i took my four by six piece i added a quarter of an inch all the way around and i'll explain why i did that uh in a minute uh, I added a quarter of an inch all the way around and I'm cutting this out to make a, a viewfinder and actually to make a drawing thing because that way I can cut things easy and I can just cut them with the scissors. So I'll show you in a minute why I made the extra quarter of an inch, but 
um, it has to do with gluing it back, gluing it to my um, my base, my, what do you call that thing? The base card is got a name. <sighs> Substrate. <sighs> Substrate. Yeah. <laughs> and he's working on a vintage looking butterfly botanical journal from, oh. Oh, that'll be How beautiful. Fun. Beautiful. Anyways, this is just a. Uh, um, yeah, I uh, think that's worth taking the time to do. Yes, and I just picked up a piece of cardstock that was big enough. Um, but the reason for the extra quarter of an inch so is you, to make it easier to glue. When you when you cut a piece of paper, just a minute, let me get this off here. So you're cutting your square bigger. Yes, I I, I cut my. I'm, I cut my internal square bigger by a quarter of an inch all the way around. Here, it goes like this. See? Okay, because where are my images now? I have I have a little folder with all my big images in them. I, I actually put it all in a folder. I, I got, you know. Uh -huh. Okay, let's take an image out of here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see here. Okay. Let's go with this rhinoceros one. Because I love this rhinoceros. Okay. And I want the rhinoceros to kind of be off the page. But that's okay. So, I'm going to just... I know I have a little quarter of an inch extra. Right? That's Okay. But where's my pencil? I just had my pencil. Okay. So now I can just roughly, oops, that's a scribble line. See, because, you know, Tanya was roughing it. I can just use my scissors, which is kind of faster than, ugh. I guess I should have used a slightly heavier piece of cardboard, but that's all right. Oh, blast. You okay? Yes, but my scissors are on the other side of the world. I'll be right back. You know, I've been fussy cutting, so um, I've been using my favorite scissors. Hello, Andrea. Understanding not life-threatening, thank God, but still not fun. Yes. Um, okay, so now I can just roughly cut this out, right? Doesn't have to be perfect. Nothing big deal. Oh, this this um this this guy is definitely going to get used somewhere along the line. So we're going to save him. Okay. So now I have this image, and if I take my little book, and since I'm going to use um glue stick to glue these on with. What I need to do is I'm going to glue it and put this down like that. But it is... <laughs> you said make it a quarter of an inch bigger. And I was going to and I didn't. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> I guess I guess you'll know how to do that. Um, I'll just cut them. The, I'll make another line. and Yeah, the, the other side of the world. To the was... inside line. The other side of the world is just one of those things. Anyways, because this is a quarter of an inch bigger, when I go to put the silly glue stick on there, you know, you can never really get right along the edge. And that's when things don't go on real well. So this gives me an extra edge. So it makes it easier to get it, the glue right on the edge. I have a little bit more to hold on to. So, 
that is why I did the extra quarter of an inch. I was thinking about which glue I was using, that kind of thing. Put that over there. Now, when I put this on here and I put it down, and if it's not perfectly lined up, it also will still have image on it. Although, you know, we want it perfectly lined up. Or as perfect as it can be. But if you cut these pages exactly the same, <clears throat> I can guarantee they won't go together as easily as if they are a little bit bigger. Okay. And with glue stick, the more you stick that down like that, the better off you are. Okay. Where's... I need a piece of... Trash paper. Okay, now if I just let this dry for a minute or two, the edges will be stuck. Of course not. That was not smart. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to tape it back together. Oh, Joyce. Oh. That, that's, that's hard. Okay, so, as soon as that dries, I'll cut it out. But that's why I did the extra quarter of an inch, so that it's easier to get the glue right along the edge of your picture. That's my plan. So, and, and now, when I cut this out, which it's probably going to be still a little sticky, now I can just go back and cut it out. Well, mine's not going to be. It does Yeah, it's perfect. not one of those. It's just going to be close. That's all that yeah. really matters, I think. And that's all that really matters. Yeah, that that's the whole point. It's just to have a little more, um, so that you get the glue on the on the edges. That it's just so hard to get the glue right on the edge of a piece of paper. And that's my first page because I think it's kind of cool. I do so, too. Um, now, then the next thing is, is I realized when I turned this over that there might be one that I liked on this side. Except, see, it's too, it's too short. So... That's okay. Gonna... I'll think about that page. Because, see, there's also this really cool background right here. That oh, would be yeah. a really that would be a really fun background. So we'll we'll wait and see on that one. See what I decide to do. Um I had this fun one. But I knew it would be hard for me to, to decide where to put the image if I didn't have something to look through. Yeah. Okay, and these will make little images right here. So, you know. What exactly is a background? Oh, hi, Kathy. Um, Lisa, can you please show your Nomad book for Kathy? Yeah. Um, Kathy, Lisa has been doing, uh, these fun collages in this book called The Nomad Book. It is a book of images with large, oh, you better make yourself big because they, she, they can't see it very well. Um, with large scale prints in it. And it's just basically that... pictures that 
she has See, I added some in. dinosaurs into this one. Yeah, she goes in and collages on those backgrounds. Um which is a lot added of fun. These two things into that one. And she was making one the other day, but when you go across the gutter, that's a gutter. I discussed this with Helen the other night. That's a gutter. Um, it um, it does this thing where it's not, it cracks is what happens. Okay, so see, this one doesn't work either. So some of the images I pulled are not going to work. It's just the way they are. That's all right. I have lots, and I can pull some more. And <clears throat> I didn't one really that I did, where I added these birds in, and her, or the animals all, I added all of those in. I added okay. some of these, but some of the butterflies were already here. I added the, the, the window was there, so I added the dog and the little girl and the flowers. I added this bouquet over here. Um, I added the cats over here and the, the bird and the cat, this and the girl. I'll added all of that in over here. But sometimes when you're looking at it through the screen, it's hard to tell what was there and what was added, you know. Yep. Mm -hmm. which is makes it fun but hi Andrea I'm glad you're here hi Kill I'm glad you're here anybody else I forgot to say hi to I'm glad you're all here anyway I'm just using different things to make some backgrounds and uh, one of them was this card I'm going to use that to make this a background but I put glue too far out so I gotta let that one sit a while Oh yeah, I'm I'm going to be uh, definitely letting letting these sit once I glue them. You can make me back on the page. Oh, thank you. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Gutter like in bowling. Yeah, that's what the, that's what the center of a book or a magazine page is called is a gutter. And actually there's it depends on the magazine. Sometimes there's a they call that center sec that whole center section. But sometimes you just have to look around to see is there anything on this that's interesting enough to give me something to play with right that's it i mean and uh i'm not opposed to putting two images on the same um on the same page like um that one image that i set back i'll show it to you in just a minute um i may down the road put it with something else over the top of it because of not liking the let me see where what did I do with it? Okay, here it is. This image has these words, so I can't actually use this part of the image like I kind of wanted to, but maybe I could find another piece to go up here that, you know, so yeah, we'll wait and see. That's kind of what I'm faced with on this one is there's words down here, mm -hmm. and then I have people's legs if I do that so then yeah, i'm moving it up to little... include those people you know mm -hmm. yep that's why but remember you got a quarter of an inch big bigger oh so yeah if you slide see, it that would there. get rid of pretty much get rid of him and them so yeah see yeah so... i think i'm gonna wait i'll use this one on a smaller book or something or you know you just gotta look at them to, to see to to yeah that's it you kind of gotta look at them And another thing is that I am going to bind my book horizontally, period. So I'm making all of my images go horizontal. Yeah, me too. Now, this is technically a you vertical You wouldn't have image. to, but that's... <laughs> no, you wouldn't have to. This is technically a vertical image, but I can turn it. Yeah. 
like Can't that. The and, and that is my intention. But this one, I probably wouldn't use because it is actual vertical because I'm going to turn this one in. Let's see how much extra is on it. I can just cut it out and stick it in the middle. Yeah. Okay. Okay, and I really liked this, but I think it's... Okay, I'm not going to use that. I don't think there's <laughs> any way for me to make that work that will make me happy. So, but I think this will work. <sighs> yeah, it helps with the audition of the picture. It really does, because even though... And sometimes what you think would be really cool, then when you look at it, you're like, well, you know, not really so much. After not really so much. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yep. And, you know, plus <clears throat> cutting something exactly straight without using the cutter. Just using your scissors to cut an image for the um, thing is, you know, <clears throat> not always easy. So that's another reason why to make your images a little bit bigger before you glue them down so that you can um, have a little bit more wiggle room with your scissors and i think i'll glue a few because that will make me happy okay but i need my glue book what did i do with my glue book oh here it is uh, i need something um <laughs> sturdier than this i need to just get me a picture frame i mean a mat board yeah, yeah or a piece of cardboard yeah it it was a little flimsy i have to agree to that one okay We had, Hannah was supposed to take the driving test yesterday. Uh -huh. And the, um, there's a video you have to watch. Yep. And it's called Impact. Anyway, oh, in the state of Texas, that's the video you have to watch before you can, you know, if you're an adult driver. Mm -hmm. um, anyway, she watched it last time and she said, oh, mom, that's, she said, I'm not going to use my cell phone. If I just make a promise, to, can I not watch this? She said, I've heard how horrible it is. Um, it's just, I think, accident after accident after accident. And um, anyway, she just waited too long. Because if you wait three months before you get your license, I mean, before you take the test, you have to take watch that video again. Video again. Oh, so dear. Now she has to watch it again and then go back to take her test again. And... Um, 
you know, we we didn't realize that. We thought it was the end of the month, but it wasn't. So, so we didn't get to do that yesterday. And then we had to take the dog to the vet. And uh, praise the Lord, he did well. Um, yeah, I just didn't know how he was going to behave. But he did good. Well, that's good. Mm. I know I got that one on there. A little crooked. We'll see how it is when I get it off. But that's all right. We want to just have mashed potatoes as a background? Well, that's why I was thinking about that. Those, those stormy skies, you know. I, I thought the stormy skies might be fun, too. So. <laughs> Why not? There you go. Why See? Um, yeah. Well, it's amazing how many times a day we get behind people using their cell phones. It's well, they always got one or two questions that are the way they word them or something that mm -hmm. make it, you know. Mm -hmm. But she did fine with the rules and signs test. She doesn't have to take that again. She just has to watch this video again so that she can, um, you know, go in and take the road test again. Anyway, she took off a half a day to do both of those things, and then we only and got then, one of them done. Um, yeah. And so she'll have to take it off again um, to do the other one. But anyway, we were proud of the puppy. Julie's here. Hi, Julie. Hi, Julie. I'm glad you're here. <laughs> well, you'd have to have a hill to park on um, to, to worry about that kind of thing. But uh, I have uh, I have been before parked on a hill and it made a difference, especially if you drive a stick. But Okay, one more, and then I'm going to trim these. And I'm not even going to bind these until um, I get, you know, into it. I probably, you know, these could be used as postcards, too. They, it would be a fun way to, to make postcards for Happy Mail or whatever. Yeah, well, I was going to say, I'm not planning to worry about binding them until I'm done doing whatever I'm going to do to them. Mm-hmm, that's it. Okay. And I'm going to have to have more air conditioning. That did not help. Jeff, could I get another degree, please? It's usually not that bad, except in this silly corner. And of course, lights and everything make a difference. But thank you. Uh oh, what's Julie wound up about? Yesterday at work was diabolical. Oh, goodness, oh, Julie. Dear. I hope it's better today, too. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm trying to decide. Yes or no? Yes or no? Oh, I kind of like it. <laughs> okay, I kind of like too. it. Besides the fact that, you know, the whole point is to have things that are different and odd. And that's what the the your, the whole Nomad book is kind of like. It's because the images are 
are not they're not just everyday images yeah you know i had to really dig to pull out um a, a lot of times because my images come from magazines they're similar for a whole pile and then you go on to the next magazine and you get something different the other thing is is i'm going to tell you when you're looking for small images look at the ads in the magazines see how that one came out that was really cool I like that one. oh yeah i like that one mm -hmm. this is one of those chances that we've talked about before of looking at photos a completely different way yes mm -hmm. you know to not look at everything the same way look at the look at pieces of it sometimes i look at a photograph just for the color of it um And sometimes the little scenes end up being, you know, just fun, but sometimes they end up being just crazy. And that's fine by me. Yeah, crazy's fun too. <laughs> <laughs> just like my, my little tiny collage uh, blue book composition book. It's like, if it's not fun, it's just, oh well. I'm not going to do it. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to have to turn my air conditioner up too. I mean, up down. or down. Yeah. I already turned it down some. I usually keep it on 79 because in my living room with the fan going, that's great. Yeah. But well, we keep I don't ours have a fan in the dining room. We the the rest of the house is 80. Um, we that's what we keep it at normally, and most of the time that's fine in here. See, this is, I don't have any of the, I have to look to see if I have any, like, images where, um, these are more nat nature images, so I have to yeah. look to see if I have some more um, that are, mm, like, interiors and stuff like that, so. Yeah. Because... Okay, where did the house one go? There it is. I knew I did another one. Julie got her new tablet, but she didn't have the brain power to set it up. Well, I understand that. I understand that. Well, I haven't... I, I, I was telling Lisa, um, Mom keeps telling me one thing at a time to find for her. And um, I hunted all over for this conditioner. She told me Tuesday that she wanted. And uh, I, I, as hard as it was to find on the internet, I knew that running around town was going to be a lost cause. So I think they've changed the, the name of it is what's happened. Because when I went directly to the site, they don't have it. So... I found the last container of it at a Walmart down the highway, and they're shipping it. So, well, at least you were able to find one. Yes, but it took me an hour, and it's like, okay, for but I, if I'd have driven around to find it, I'd have been, you know, it had been way more than that hour. Yeah. Okay, so these are weird images. Oh, that'll be fun to work with. Mm -hmm. That's what I thought. But I have to decide because there are some words. A humanity you know nothing of. You're living in this polished. Do I want to? I could possibly do two. I could stick it right in the middle. Let's see here. Oh, oh, oh. I think I want Hi Ben.
Beth. We're glad you're here. Hi, Beth. The dog I went past is gorgeous. Hint, hint. <laughs> okay, I'll go back and look. <laughs> okay, this ought to be fun. And that was one of the things when I was going through my images to look for these page page backgrounds, I was trying to find images that weren't all Are you just talking about this one that looks like Sparrow? <laughs> He doesn't look exactly like him at all, but he's got the, some of the similar markings. Sparrow is much handsomer. <laughs> Maybe she has enough him. dog in her life. <laughs> I do have enough dog in my life. But uh, but he was he was so good. I was so proud of him. The vet techs came in and they wanted one of them to hold him and one of them to give him his vaccinations because they were worried about his you know behavior. <laughs> mm -hmm. I was a little worried too, but I thought he would act better if I held him than if strangers did. Mm -hmm. um, but anyway, uh, we went ahead and let him do it, and um, he did great. Oh, and they good. were, you know, telling him what a good boy he was the whole time. And then when they let go of him, he was just, oh, I did so good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. He's a wiggly mess. It was hilarious. I just love the color of this. Oh, I, just, I just thought it was so pretty, the color of it. So that is definitely going to be one. Okay. Yeah. And of course, you know, we'll have to put something weird in here, like um, two big chairs or, you know, or some, you know, incongru incongruous. Is that how you say that word? I think so. Incongruent. Yeah. Yeah. My pronunciation has not has gotten worse and worse over the t over time. When poor Jeff dumped the garbage cans and now they're full again. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'm thinking I can get two out of this one because uh, this white is kind of fun. Oh, uh huh. It goes there and then. Oh, yeah, I can get two. I can get two. Okay, so first we're going to go right there. Yeah. Like that. Um. Then we have to look it up here. What do we want to do up here? Do we want to, let's go all the way over here. Let's keep those rocks. So that's bottom. Yeah, you need the rocks. Yeah, we need the rocks. So there have was something some, sitting on them. Yeah, have have weird, you know, things sitting on them. Like, you know, I don't know. A yoga lady standing up there doing really weird yoga on a rock in the middle of the woods, right? Mm -hmm. oh, there you go. I can't oh, do yoga. Let a, I can't do yoga, let alone do it on the rocks in the middle of the woods. So. Oh, goodness, no. 
I might could do that chair yoga. <laughs> Well, I'm going to tell you, if mom can do chair yoga, I think you could do it too. So, That's good. I can't find my line. Oh, there it is. Okay. If you hold it just right, you can see it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Hey, I think I saw you in here earlier, but I'm not positive. Yep, I thought so. Say hi again, just in case. Yep. Well, and hello to anybody if we've missed you. I'm sorry. Yes. I'm, I'm not doing a really good job of, oh, there it is. I'm not doing a really good job of paying attention to chat today. Mm. Oh. My brain's having a hard time even looking at pictures, much less trying to look at pictures and chat. Normally, yeah. I don't have much trouble doing that, but today, today I'm, I'm a little foggy. Yeah, well, it, it sucks. It's just so hot. This is so unbelievably hot. That's... Okay, this is the one I was thinking about using. Oh, yeah. Can't wait to see what you find to put in her hand. But with this quarter of an inch bigger, you have to be careful because I'm either I either will lose his fingertip or his hair. I've chosen to lose his hair. Yeah. So, but I'm thinking this might be fun too to have his foot in here. That is a really weird picture. So you know. I just like his leg. We're going to make a page because, you know, if we don't like it, we don't have to use the page, right? That's true. But not only that, you know, sometimes we have to do stuff we don't like. Okay, ladies, our hostesses aren't paying attention to chat. Any mischief we can get up to, that doesn't require me to move from this spot. <laughs> Okay, uh-huh. Andrea's going to make trouble. I can tell already. She's making trouble. Mm -hmm. All right. Hmm. Hmm. What does that mean? I like that the composition. Mm -hmm. but I'm but you're gonna to think, have to be, what on earth would I you add to that? I don't know, but remember you're going to lose the bottom of your flower when you put your yeah. piece in the middle. So slide down a little further. There you go. It's better to lose the top one than to lose the bottom one, I think. I think so, too. And you never know. Maybe you could find a... Um, well, I think I'm going to put it just against the bottom of it. Okay. That well, way I won't when, lose the bottom, but... Yeah, because when you glue your piece of thing on... Wait, wait, wait. When, isn't it a quarter inch bigger? It is, but I'm going to put my card against the bottom. Oh, all right. After all I right. cut it down. All right. I see. Okay. I didn't state that in a way that would make it easy to understand. Okay. <laughs> you might want to glue that one on right away so you don't forget it. 
yeah well i'm doing them as i pull them out so oh you have been okay yeah i'm being lazy partially because i don't like glue yeah well i just wanted to have them um, have chance to rest so you can trim them mm -hmm. yeah well i did a few and then i i um cut out some more so now i have some more cut out so i can glue them down and poor jeff emptied the trash and with all this trash again oh poor man well trash is a never-ending thing yeah and to, just tomorrow, is. tomorrow is pickup day so you know Oh, I had this image, too, that I was, I don't remember why it's folded, but it's folded. But I think it will make a cool one. I think it was in your box, folded up in your box. Yeah, I think it was. And it's all right, because I'll do something, you know, that makes that go away. But not right this minute. <laughs> Right this minute, I do I have enough of these? I don't know. How many do I? How many did I glue already? Oh yeah, one, two, three, four, five. So I've glued five. That means I have probably seven more. Mm. Yay! Barbara might be done in a bit. Actually, Linda will be done, but. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, Andrea is telling Barbara to behave. Now, I it's Andrea that we have to worry about, isn't it? <laughs> Maybe she's turned over a new leaf. <laughs> uh, okay, did you hear me snort? Uh -huh, uh -huh. I did, I heard that. <laughs> She's yeah. becoming the um, attitude police, I guess. <laughs> oh, I see, okay. All right. Okay, now this was kind of interesting. Ooh, I think that is really cool. Uh-huh. Can't decide if I like that better. Or that. I don't really like just a minute a bit of box there. Yeah. But I really like that. Oh, yes, I do too. Yeah, if you act up in, in the waiting room, they do, they do get grumpy. They do. Uh-huh. Maybe I take off a little bit of it and show, well, I don't know. Okay, I got to get this page out because it's all crookedy and it makes it harder to. Um... Mm -hmm. Oh, and it's, of course, it's, oh, that, that's not good. Okay, there we go. It didn't, it didn't, it didn't come out right, huh? Is that the deal? Well, it got stuck to the page beneath it. Oh, okay. We haven't done a collage book in a long time, I don't think. Nope. It's definitely time. Mm -hmm. Okay, Kel's, Kel and Andrea are, are 
parked together, I guess. They're they're um they're gonna hold down the fort. Well, I'm having trouble deciding. I'm going to take the shade back to Lowe's. Okay. It's marked as 37 inches. It's only 33 inches when I put it up there. <laughs> I mean, the packaging says 37 inches. And it's 33, it's 33 inches long? 33 inches long. Okay. Yeah. Well, um, it, it's inside the window. It won't even cover the blind. No, uh uh. Well, that's fine. Um, if you can't get a 37 one, I could probably order one. Yeah. Okay. Okay, be careful. Love you. Okay. Oh, the poor guy. He brought a blackout shade the other day and... and was gonna just was gonna hang it up just now and um apparently the package is marked 37 but it's only 33 inches wide well that's not good no i mean it's like <laughs> yay barbara linda's then she gets to go home. Okay, Barbara, Good. just be careful going home. Drive safe. Mm hmm. Oh, I didn't tell y'all. Jeff's MRI came back completely normal. There's nothing wrong with his brain. That's wonderful. Yeah. It doesn't help us, though, because it doesn't take care of whatever's causing all these horrible migraines. Yeah. I don't know. I remember what that was like when they can't ever give you a diagnosis. Mm -hmm. Just send you to yeah. a different doctor. Maybe they can give you a diagnosis. Ooh, maybe they can give you a diagnosis. But he did figure out some of the possible pain in his knee and stuff so that's um he gave us a, a different a different suggestion as to what's causing it oh okay uh, it's it's not really good because neuropathy is not a good thing but it's not bad neuropathy but it's it's something that at least we kind of have an idea of why things are doing what they're doing yeah so and he goes to the VA Monday. So maybe we can get the medicine that he can start back on the medicine. I hope so. Yeah. Okay. Is that prime truck for here? Oh, that figures it's not supposed to be here till Saturday. If it is, I have to go get it off the porch because I don't want it to sit outside. I don't blame you. Okay, and then I didn't put it on square. Yeah, cleaning the MRI is a, a real breath blessing. Um, they had done a brain scan, something or other thing here a few weeks ago. But um, the neurologist he saw a couple weeks ago um, wanted an MRI. So he did that a couple weeks ago, and they called him the other day. And said that uh, these recipes look good. <laughs> yeah, they all look good, and then you have to make them. I don't know. Okay, I don't know what the prime guy is doing because he's sitting there in the van. <sighs> So he's making me have to watch him. And if something is coming today, it has not told me it was coming. So we had to get new solar lights. Um, 
because we got three that are out. And um, Jeff wanted to get them up before we go off. And he's played with the old ones several times. And we have four of them, right? We have four solar lights that come on. They're supposed to come on anytime something gets in front of them. Motion activated. Right. Okay. The one by my car where when I pull up, as soon as I open my door, that light comes on. It's worked since the day he put it up there seven years ago. One to the front of the house. On the other end of the house, it barely ever comes on. For some unknown reason, it will not come on. The one on the back of the house that um, <clears throat> we had come on many, many, many times because of animals, you know, like, um, okay, so he went away. Yeah. Um, no, Maybe I guess just doing some paperwork or something. Probably. Um, no, I have something coming for mom that I, it's food. I don't, uh, it's crackers. I don't want to sit. Outside. Oh yeah. I don't blame you. <laughs> So uh, that's why it's not supposed to come till Saturday because I knew I would be here all day Saturday. So mm -hmm. um, anyways, so Oops. one has worked itself fine for years and now it doesn't work. Two have hardly ever come on and yet uh, they don't want to work. One of them, which gets used eh, part of the good part of the time because I don't come in a lot at, at dark. But it comes on just fine. So three out of four are not working. So, and he went to the store last week to try to find new ones. And none of, none of them were quite the, what he wanted. So I ordered them. So they're supposed to be here Saturday too. Oh. Deliver my stuff or leave. That Don't park out front. That's right. Don't park out front. And especially in the middle of the road. He was in the middle of the road. Jeff couldn't get out the driveway. <coughs> oh, okay. I got to clean up my table. It's a mess. <coughs> okay, I have one more. You all right? <coughs> no, she's not. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think... Okay, I have to see the shoulder doctor Monday. Jeff has to see the VA guy. You know, we only have next week, and then we're going to be gone. So Jeff said, get your act together, Tanya. I'm like, okay, I'm trying. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> how long are y'all planning to be gone this time? Mm, we'll come home by, you know, Thanksgiving, I think. <clears throat> yeah. Um. And it kind of depends on how the weather is because if it gets like snowy, which I don't really expect in October, in Maine even because it's been so hot, um, then we'll have to come home sooner. Uh, I just don't expect that to happen. But we're doing northeast, and so you know it could be it could be that we have to head further south. But um, I, I I expect like the middle of November is kind of what it's kind of what we're looking at. Unless something happens. So September, October, and half of November probably. Yep. Mm hmm. Yep. Well, we're not leave, we're not technically leaving until no September fifth. We're going to leave oh. after the holiday. Um, we uh, we don't want to be on the road for the holiday. I don't blame you. <clears throat> it's just not worth it. We don't have to go anywhere, you know. <coughs> without permission, I'm I'm leaving without permission. That is true. Mm -hmm. Mm 
The other thing is the way the water is out in the Gulf, we may be in for a lot of storms this fall. So um, if we get something big, we'll have to come home. That is always one of those things. Usually, usually the, the storm situation has passed by the time we leave in the fall. This year, not so much. You know, this one might be fun, too. Hmm. I kind of like that. Yep, yep, yep. Hmm. Oh, I kind of like that a lot. <laughs> okay. okay. Let's move this over here, though, because we... Andrew, you tucked me in the RV somewhere. There you go. Uh huh. Tiny. Uh, I actually have basement cupboards big enough to put a person in. It'd be hot and bumpy down there, but you know. And usually, I fill the we fill them up with stuffs. You know, that I have to be able to shop while we're gone. I was going to say, either stuff's going out or stuff's coming back. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. I usually take two empty containers in the basement so that when I shop, I have a place to put the stuff that you know, I bring home. <laughs> yeah. But last time, last time I was really bad. <laughs> and we shopped, of course, we shopped a little more because of the, some of the things we did and some of the places we were. Um, we didn't. We weren't as many places with hiking trails and things like that. And uh, so we were, we were, had, we had more towns and, and stuff this last time. We were in cities more. And the whole week in Omaha was, you know, a lot of shopping. We, that was, you know, couldn't help myself there. It's okay. We enjoyed watching your haul videos. Yeah. Well, when it took that many to do, usually I only have to do one. So. Oh yeah, that came out real cool. Oh, that will be fun to do something with. I don't know what. But something. Plus, when and when we were in Wetumpka, um, Patty and I went shopping more than one day. And usually, I only get to go shopping just a little bit with Patty. And going shopping with Patty means, you know, I hit a, we hit a lot of stores. And um, we got some good deals last time. That's good. Jeffrey says if we get the new RV, um, that I won't have as much place to put stuff. So we're talking about getting a bigger one. <laughs> it's 3.3 inches longer. Oh, that's going to make tons of difference, I'm sure. No, not inches, feet. Three, three, three feet, three inches is okay, longer. Okay, that might actually make some difference. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna it, it's gonna make a big difference. Uh huh. I, I I'm gonna have three feet 
plus what it is is it he, we're talking about a bunkhouse model and using the bunks as storage spaces yeah because the these renegades do not have near the storage in them the closets are way smaller everything everything about the inside uh, the yeah. house part is not the same so the renegade oh, yeah, that's, that came what, out that's good. what darren wanted was a renegade uh-huh watched yep. tons and tons of videos and those were his favorite ones yep yep the renegades and and they they mm -hmm. yep um chef ran into the guy who sold us the one we have right now yeah um or you know took care of us when we were trying to buy it that kind of thing he quit where the place where um where we got it he uh he kind of retired from there yeah and he's but he's back to work there doing something different he's not a salesperson anymore and jeff ran into him the, uh this morning getting lp and um uh Je he said something to jeff about the the well tiffin makes one and jeff said yeah but they screwed up <laughs> he said, yeah. they didn't they didn't put it on a big enough truck It's going to be underbuilt for sure. Okay, now I don't know which way I have to put this thing on here because I didn't put it in the middle. Oh, Cindy's here. Hi, Cindy. Hi, Cindy. Glad you're here. Okay, where's where is it? Which way? This way. Okay. Sticky. I have twelve done. I think I have to do. I have to do one. I just have to do one. I have twelve backgrounds made. Okay. Are you not gonna stick? Yeah. All right, you know, I need a new glue book is what I need. Okay. I don't know how many I've got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I thought I had more than that, but that's all I see. Ten, I guess ten, and then this one. Well, I and I was cutting out a bunch of little stuffs for, um, you know, to to think about putting on these things the other night. So I just cut out a bunch of tiny of little pictures. That's all I did. I just cut out a bunch of little stuff. I have no idea what I'm going to use, but I fussy cut for a couple of nights. You know, and this would be just kind of normal. I could just put him in his hand just like that. Except that it's a giant bird for such a small person. So say that's not very normal for a hummingbird to be that big. <laughs> be that big, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. he, he could look he could really look at him like that, yeah. We'll see. We'll see. We have to. We have to do some. Have to do something fun. I don't know what. Oh, we've got a lizard. He could have a lizard on his hand too. Or on his arm. Or on his head. He could be a lizard headband. <laughs> The lion could sit on his hand.
They kind of like this lady. Oh, that's cool. I'm just going to trim some of them now until I find the one I think I'm going to work on. <laughs> Thank you, Andrea. That is a wonderful prayer sentiment, however you want to put that word, but yes, and amen, amen. Mm-hmm. We will continue to keep you in our prayer, Cindy. I think I like the chicken better than the um let's see. let's bring you in a little bit so you can see better. Yeah, the chicken's fun. Yeah, I think I like the chicken better than the um than the uh well that's a little too close, sorry. Um, I like, I think I like the chicken better than the, um, hummingbird. Mm -hmm. I like them both. Mm -hmm. He could have a fork in his teeth. <laughs> he could. All it takes is for you to have one and wanting to have it there. <laughs> well, I have one. <laughs> I have a fork. Uh -huh. Well, you're good to go then. You just have to decide if that's what you want. <laughs> I don't think it's what I want. It does. <laughs> I like the chicken, but I'm not sure that the fork is going to do it. Uh-huh. Maybe the, the rose chicken should have the, maybe the maybe the chicken mouth. should have the fork. Okay. There, the chicken could have the fork. See, I kind of like the chicken having the fork. <laughs> yeah, the chicken works good. Can't believe it's already after three o'clock. Yep, the chicken needs the fork. I'm gonna put the chicken the fork in the chicken's mouth. Yeah, but yeah, I like that. I have to I have to take the chicken and take the other chicken off of there. Or yeah, the other chicken and the eggs off. And then I have to cut out his legs because I don't I didn't cut out his legs down here because then they get all tore up. Yeah, those eggs look like lemons from here. <laughs> yeah, I know. I thought they were a little yellow, too. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think they're supposed to be golden eggs. Oh, okay. Do not ask me so. why the chickens have the golden eggs. Because, you know, that doesn't they quite make sense. jealous of the goose. I guess so. So...
Okay. Come on, chicken. Don't do that. Oh, I tore his leg. Uh-oh. If it's a chicken, it's a her, but you know. I'll have to fix it. Okay. Okay, threw away my book because I really got another book. My glue book has, has gone down drastically, so I had to get another glue book. And I knew I was going to need it. There's so many things to watch out there. Um, pockets of junk mail, envelopes, windows. Also watch. Yeah. Um, I didn't even get our same six Wednesday, Wednesday videos watched until Sunday. I think it was Sunday that I finally got them watched. Which is not, you know, normally I try to watch them when they come out. But. Yeah. Well, you've had a little bit to do. Oh, there's my mashed potatoes. <laughs> that was a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Uh -huh. mm. Just a little bit. And it would, it would be easier if it wasn't so hot. I will tell you that being so unbearably hot. It's making stuff hard to do. Just shopping yesterday was exhausting. I'm watching decluttering videos, trying to get my... <laughs> My gum shut up. I see. Okay, is it helping? Yeah, it actually is helping. Okay. Um, but I'm, I'm just, you know, it's just, you think, oh, I'm going to do this today. And it doesn't sound like it's really even that much. But you get almost done and you're like, oh, my goodness. I don't know if I can do any more. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. And, and, okay, I made a list of things this morning that I needed to get done before 1.30. Um, I think I did about half of them, which means now the things I have to do tonight, I'll have to go and and maybe, you know, try to get those other things done. Yeah. Okay. Ta-da! I, think I page, like it. I think the page is done. It's done. Oops, fall. Don't don't fall over. Okay, so I gotta trim this page up so that it's done too. Oh, Barbara got home. Yay! Thank you, I Barbara. Hope they can get some rest. Yeah. Well, if she took that medicine that they gave you to get in the MRI, then they, she probably will rest. <laughs> it's very helpful, huh? <laughs> well, um, I had to do it without the last time because Jeffrey, um, of course, I've only had ever have one MRI, but I warned her. I said she better have a bucket when I came out of there because likely as not, if I managed to make it through it, I would probably be having to lose my lunch she said what i said <clears throat> um going in that thing is going to be difficult she had a bucket for me i didn't need it i was very surprised oh i'm very glad you didn't I need did it good. i did good yep okay let's see here that looks like a postcard doesn't it yeah, it looks like a postcard just with the image. 
Okay. Okay, so. Mm -hmm. Were you, are you doing them on the front and the back? No, nope, I'm just going to do them on the front. Um, I made the decision to do that more than anything because I felt like if I did that, then um, if I choose to um, use them as a postcard, yeah, I can just use them as a po I can just cover them with some Mod Podge and use them as a postcard. <coughs> so that's why right. I did that. Well, that's smart. Well, I decided not to worry about something on the back because sometimes I like to cut and slide something underneath. Oh, uh-huh. And yeah. I could do that this way. Yep. And then I could just put some backing on it if I need to. Catching this video made me dig up my collage stuff. Yay! That's what we want. Our guest in Wisconsin at the kitchen table drawing Bert. What, 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 what? She took the meds, but I'm sleepy. <laughs> our guest is ensconced at the kitchen table drawing birds on fabric and listening to a podcast. Time for a nap. Yay. Okay, I think. Um, this this little squirrel needs to have be cut out, I think. I have decided to make him get sit in this tree. He's a giant squirrel and I have a giant bird. I think a squirrel is going to sit in this tree somehow. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. The squirrel's going to sit up there, and this giant cardinal is going to sit on the ground over here. But I have to trim this guy out because <clears throat> I certainly couldn't trim him ahead of time. Okay. Oops. All right, let's see how many I've got here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven. I only cut out about 30. So, <laughs> I mean, well, I pieces, of, only, pieces of wood. I mean, board. Uh, cards are, yeah, um, I cut 12, but um, I, I glued 12 backgrounds down too. So I'll probably cut the rest of my, well, I don't know if I'll cut the rest of the cardstock up because uh, I may cut one more piece just simply because the container I have to put them in is um won't hold the 12 by 12 cardstock very well so oh yeah if i if i cut them down a little bit um <clears throat> i was in hobby lobby yesterday and they have 12 by 12 um things but i think i have some 12 by 12 pages and this is small enough that it probably would sit in a page if i hunted up you know page and maybe sewed across the bottom or something maybe that would be a good idea i'll have to see about that find some way to make some small 12 by 12 pockets because that way the the um project could be put away mm -hmm. more easily that's my plan is to try to put it away more easily yeah 
Okay, we got a squirrel and a giant cardinal. I like it. I'm not sure if it needs something more or not, so we'll have to see. Do we need to put this? Um, nope. We might have to put a monkey down here just because. <laughs> yeah, because, just because. Uh huh. <laughs> Because... The squirrel is killing her. It's so cute. Yeah, I think the squirrel is adorable. <clears throat> or we could put um, Mr. and Mrs. Um, Gingerbread going in the house. Yeah. That might be more fun. I think Mr. and Mrs. Gingerbread need to go in the house. Let's cut them out completely. And you know, I know I have some cardstock that I had pulled out for to make postcards on and stuff that had the same ideas. You use up the cardstock you don't really like, or the ones you know you'll never use. Uh -huh. Do you think I could find them? <clears throat> yeah, I had some in a special place too, and I couldn't find them either. Okay, so. Mr. and Mrs. Gingerbread are headed in the house, and the squirrel and the cardinal are watching. I love over. it. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, Lisa's getting sleepy. I am. <laughs> I have not been sleeping very well. It's between heat and 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 stress i totally get it yeah i'm gonna see what we can have coming out of this hidey hole over here there we go where's my where's my card oh i lost the card Ugh. well it's not like i don't have 50 of them Oh, Mr. and Mrs. Gingerbread had to come out of the house. Yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. They're, going, they're going in the house is what they're going to do. They're going in the house. Oh, and the card's laying right there. I just couldn't see it. Sleep is catching up to me. Yep. Goodbye. Sleep well. Bye, Andrea. I have to tell you that Helen asked me what it was we were going to do today. Um she heard part of it Sunday and not all of it. So rather I rather than try to text her back and forth, I called her about it and uh, we were discussing it and she said, um, what kind of glue was I going to use? And I told her I thought I was going to use glue stick because, you know, I have a lot of glue sticks. <laughs> yeah. She was with, she's the one that found them. So, oh, all those. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, she's the one that found them. Okay. there, There's the second one. So I've got two done. I got the chicken with the fork and, um, you know, a squirrel with the gingerbread. Well, I got to get busy. <laughs> I was well, making a couple background, more backgrounds. How many backgrounds have you got? Well, now I have 13. <laughs> So you have an extra background from me. So, you know. Okay, those two have to sit. So let's decide what we're going to. I got to look at my stuffs to see what yep. um, mm -hmm. what I have to put on. Because I have to get at least one done. Okay. We have the three phases of share in the mountains. Do we have that? Mm -hmm. 
that we could do that. <laughs> can't see him. You can put it up there. The lion could be king of the hill. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. He could be on top of the mountain. Barbara said she loved the little path, so I'm not sure which little path she was talking about. Well, um, I don't know if it's this oh, one. Oh, that one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a really cool one. And then there's this one. It's kind of got a path, too. So I don't know. You were talking about the first one? Yeah. There's, I like this one too. The black car went with the ladies. Yeah, I don't, I just didn't like it on the mountains. It's just, you know. For some reason, it just didn't fit the mountains. I don't know what it is. Okay, most of this stuff is kind of big. These I might could use. Okay, let's set those aside. Yeah, you have I to, you know, big is okay if it's, um, if it makes it kind of a, like a statement, I think. Like a giant stork that the ladies are going to look at. There's some gnomes. Huge bird. Or maybe we should do the hummingbird. Because, you know. It could be eating the ladies. No, we don't want it to eat the ladies. <laughs> Mm, not really, probably. Yeah, not really, probably. Make a path book. Oh, that sounds fun, Barbara. Mm -hmm. That is a fun idea. I think so. What do you think about that? Oh, that's a fun image. I like that. Uh huh. In the living room. room. In the living room. Uh huh. Yeah, yep. On her boat in the living room. Okay, I'm going to set that one aside and see if there's anything else in here that I want to use. Oh, this bird might have to hold, hold this cat. Let's, let's set this one aside for the time being. Okay, here's some smaller things. I'm going to shut this and... A pterodactyl hummingbird. There you go. Uh huh. A pterodactyl hummingbird. Yep. I like this bird with its own bird cage. Uh huh. 
I don't know. Don't want to use these for this. Oh, here's another bird. Maybe we could have this bird this bird sitting on top of the bird cage. Because you know the cat is in the cage with the bird. He's sitting on top of this. No, I don't know. There's a fish. I had fish. Where are the fish? I know I had some fish. I had this fish. Okay. This fish in there. Where did I put the... Oh, there it is. Okay. Dum to dum to dum. I kind of like the raccoon a little bit there. What else could we put there? I really like the cat hanging. This bird has the cat in a cage with another bird, so it has its pets. They got quiet, probably as quiet as we got. Yeah. Okay, there's some fish. Oh, there's those sharks. Okay. Those are sharks swimming. I'm going to put those with that one for right now while I'm thinking about it. And I'm going to go ahead and um, glue my lady in the boat down. These sharks are swimming after the bird. Or are they going to eat the cat? Hmm. 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 Which, which are they going to do? Go after the bird or eat the cat? Hmm. Whichever one's easiest. Okay. Uh, you don't think they have a preference? <laughs> I think they'll go for whatever they can catch the easiest. Uh, you're probably right. Uh, one of the beaches out here had a great big 12 foot hammerhead on it here a few days ago. Yep, yep. I like that one. Let's trim okay, off the... that's it. I like it. Uh, yeah, your brain wants to do backgrounds. Filling the backgrounds is hard on a tired brain. Go for easy. That's right true. Mm -hmm. It is hard on a tired brain. Okay, we want to try to take out this little spot in the middle. See if I can do it without tearing it up. Okay. Uh -huh. well, that's a giant one, honey. The eighth inch one. Well, that's a sixth inch one. Where's the eighth inch one? We know we have an eighth inch one. We know it. That's a square one. Oh, there it is. Buried down there. Is that it? No, that's a 16th inch one. What have I done with 
the eighth inch one? Did it go out the back of the thing? Must have. I'll bet you it's behind everything in there. Okay, well, you can do it this way. Okay. I'm going to let those still percolate a little bit. Um, I kind of like, well, I like the squirrel with the dog. But mm -hmm. I also thought it would be fun to have him looking at something. Like they're all having a conversation. A conversation? Yeah. Uh-huh. Okay. That's yeah, good I think that's what I'm going to do, but I'm going to let it sit a little bit and okay. see what else we've got. Um, all right. So I'm going to stick that right down there. We could put some gnomes in front of that house. Oh, that's fun. Or we could put them over to the side. That just kind of, you know. How about that? Oh, I kind of like the bird with the gnomes. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So we'll set that over there and it can percolate a little bit too. And let's do something different here. Well, we're going to have a duck swimming in the mashed potatoes. Oh, ducks swimming in mashed potatoes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maybe some bears walking around. I don't know. That's not inspiring me too much at the moment. I think eventually it'll be fun to do, but. But not right now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. There, the sharks can't decide if they're going to eat the cat or the bird or, you know, the bird and the cat. I might be just indecisive enough to not end up with anything. <laughs> yeah. Well, I can understand that one. We could have a fish swimming in the mashed potatoes. <laughs> we could have butterflies on the cookies like they're flowers. Well, this bird could sit on this rhinoceros horn, but I'm afraid Denny's looking at the lady's butt. So we better take this lady off and maybe leave the other lady on. <laughs> I think that I could handle. I don't think I could handle with, you know. Yeah, we don't need any overly inquisitive birds. No, no. Sometimes you just have to take what you've got and look and if you find something great, if you don't, then. The bird looks like he's getting revenge on the kitty. Oh, yeah, he's feeding it. Maybe the bird is feeding the kitty to the to the sharks. <laughs> that might be it. I don't know. Mm hmm. I didn't have time to actually, you know, cut out anything new. Oh, well, that's, you know, I just, I just cut out some new stuff simply because 
I had been playing with my stuff the other day. So that meant that I didn't have a lot that I hadn't looked at. Doesn't mean I won't go back and use them. I just thought maybe it'd be a good time to get some <coughs> fresh ones. Okay, maybe if we put the lion on there and put the, oh, I kind of like that. What do we think? I think it's very cute. Uh-huh. I kind of like it. Kind of weird. Right when you see cat fur hanging from the kitty's mouth. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I think that one's it. Mm -hmm. <coughs> <coughs> Oh, Teresa's got a headache, huh? I'm sorry. I've been having a lot, but I think it's all this heat. Just coming and going in this heat is just... <coughs> the air conditioner in the car cannot keep up. It's just It just can't. Um, you stop and start again and the air conditioner has to try to cool something that's been sitting in a stupid parking lot oh I like that one that one's fun just silly 111 yep yeah, 111 is ridiculous. I, I agree. <clears throat> okay. Let's look at this one again. I can see through. Oh, I know what I can see through. There's a piece right underneath the table. Okay. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to let that one percolate a little while. Throwing on the floor. I don't know. Jeff said earlier um, before noon time, ours, our outside thermometer said 101, but I don't know what it is out there now. Okay, there's this one. I just added in that raccoon, and is that a puffin? Uh, yeah, it looks like a puffin. Anyway, for now, I, I think that one's I done. Don't think it's a, I don't think it's a penguin. I think it's a puffin. 
Yeah, it's definitely not a penguin, but. Um, mm -hmm. Do you want the blue one or do you want the. Okay, I need to trim these. Okay, there's a blue a one closer. and a green one. What other color was there? There was another color. Well, we'll just use the blue one because I don't, maybe there was another color, but I don't find it. That's okay. We don't, we don't really have to have it. And then, Thank you, Beth. Bye, Sona. Thanks, Thanks Beth. for coming. Bye, Sonia. Okay. What did I do? Okay, now that's really weird. Uh oh. Did I turn it upside down? Is that what I did? I probably did. No, I didn't. Apparently, I didn't draw very well. Oh, or what I did was use the wrong side. Yeah, I probably used the wrong side. Okay, so we will try again, see if we can do this right this time. Okay, there's that one. Well, that one's fun. Yeah. It's a good thing we have lots and lots of images because that this really didn't work. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, no, no, doesn't work. <laughs> we could put bears on there. Oh, that's fun. It's interesting that they're that they're small so much smaller than the um flowers. Yeah. They kind of fit right in there. They cover up the radishes, but mm -hmm. I can move them a little bit and then some of the radishes can peek out. We could have a bird. Birds are always good. Yeah, I think so. Okay, I have this fun, this kind of thing happening. So let's see if I can find one of the backgrounds that I like this on. Don't ask me why, but it Bye just... Bye-bye, Sana. I don't know if I said that before. Says, or not. White picket fence world, but he knows a dark world. And I'm thinking maybe this bird. On there. And then we might put this spider there 
Let me on top of that red thing. There's a spider right there. Kind of like that. How about that? Oh, that's fun. <laughs> Mom is protecting her baby from those <laughs> big bad moths. <coughs> yep. Mm -hmm. That moth might get that baby. It might. <coughs> you okay? Yeah. My allergies are just something else right now. <coughs> that, and I'm almost going to have to call the tea fairy, but we're, we're only going to go till four, right? Yeah. Yeah, I really have to get off by four at four. Okay. Well, that's fine because um <clears throat> I can last until the till then without calling the tea fairy. We're going to take a little off the bottom of this. I hope y'all out there are having fun watching us play with this. Yeah, I didn't think about asking them. <laughs> oh, what is a tea fairy? Oh, she wants a tea fairy. Yes. Tea we all want a tea fairy. <laughs> tea fairies are wonderful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay. And I also have a blind fairy that puts my blinds down every night. He doesn't put them up in the morning. I, I, I do not know what the deal is, but for some unknown reason, the blind fairy likes it dark. He's a so close he, the blinds fairy. <laughs> um, yep. So he doesn't, he doesn't put them up in the morning. I have to do that. And I've not been putting them up a lot of days just to try to keep the cool in um so. So far, so good. This dog's paw is way too long, so I'm using this um, penguin to kind of cover him up. Hide that a mm -hmm. little bit, yeah. Mm -hmm. Now we could put that little guy on the couch. Well, when you when will you take Hannah to try to? Uh... Uh, get her license then well as soon as she can um get it scheduled again they've got uh, um okay she's got to schedule it in advance you know uh well, reser mm -hmm. make a reservation appointment whatever um, yeah mm -hmm. and it's got to be on a day that works good for her boss for her to be gone so right Wednesdays usually work good, so her plan was to see if she could just do it next Wednesday. Ah, I kind of like that. It's kind of boring up there, though. Hmm. We well, could put some other flowers or some butterflies coming into the picture, or yeah, something. I'm, I'm, I'm looking. Somewhere I had a flower border kind of thing. So let me see what I can find, if I can find it. I didn't cut it all the way out because, yep, mm -hmm, there we go. Yeah, that looks nice. Mm -hmm. But I have to cut it out because <clears throat> I didn't want to leave it again. Uh, 
because it would get all bent up. So I had to Yes, Jeff likes it dark. He, uh, that's the shade he was trying to put up was a, a blackout shade. Yeah. I don't, I don't know why we need blackout shades. Just close your eyes, but you know. Well, I have to have a dark room to sleep in, and especially if I have a headache. I was going to say, uh, I think, and a lot of times it's more about when he has such an awful migraine. So yeah. Because any go. little bit of light coming in feels like it's just beating on you. Yeah. So. But he's always been like that. He's. He could he could leave the shades down all day long and sit around in the dark. I. I can't you know I can't function in the dark. Yeah. So. It's just kind of like he can do things and, and, you know, never turn the kitchen light on. And I'm like, I need to be able to see what I'm doing. So. I need to be able to see. And I really prefer not to live in a cave. <laughs> That's it. That's it. I am not a cave dweller. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. Well, Darren always wanted, you know, he was always about keeping all the shades down, but it was about privacy for him. Oh, well, the, the, in the kids always night, want yeah. the lights off if they're going to watch TV, you know. Oh, Jeff does too. But, um, and I don't mind it, like if we're watching a movie or something, but if I'm just watching T, that's one of the reasons why I don't sit in there and watch TV with him very much because I can't do anything else. You know, I can't fussy cut can't or see. Yeah. You know, if I can't see, I can't fussy cut or do any of those things. Okay, so that that's going to go up there, which makes me a lot happier. Okay, so here's this one. Got oh, a that quick critter fun. conference. Yep. Mm -hmm. Well, I did good. I got five done. Um, I think I'll have five done too. I think I'm not sure. I have to I have to finish this one and then I'll count because we really should show them off before we go. Yeah. Oh we no! I, I, to do I, that. I tore it. Oh. I knew it was gonna do that. Um, it's this particular piece is newspaper, so I kind of knew it would. Okay, so there's that part. Well, I've got one, two, three, four, four, five. You can show them off. Yeah. Okay. okay. Because you're going to show okay. off your backgrounds too, aren't you? These are the backgrounds that I haven't done anything on yet. And then I'll show you the ones I've worked on. Okay. That sounds like a plan. I like that one. That one? Mm-hmm. I think it'll yeah. be fun. I need something, you know, big on the... I don't know. <laughs> oh, here we go. Giant duck. I don't know. Anyway, I like that one too. And then here's two more that I haven't trimmed yet. But I will. And then the ones that I've done. Are these. Got the girl in the boat. In her living room. I like the girl in the boat in the living room. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's my favorite one so far. And there's the gnomes and the crane. 
needs a little something right here. I don't know what. Maybe a mushroom? Mm -hmm. Maybe so. I do have one. I'll look at it in a second. Drop Here's your hand. Critter down. Conference. Mm -hmm. I like the Critter Conference. And I like the protective mama from the moths. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Uh, well, let me see if I've got a mushroom while I'm. Yeah. I, I did have one. I don't know. I'm not seeing it now, though. Well, I made a mess again. Good grief. Well. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to make Tanya big and she can show you what. The oh, boat and lady them. is um is Cindy's favorite. Okay, so these are the ones that I haven't done anything to yet. There's that one. And oh, I, I like that, that one. Depending upon what I do with it, I haven't decided which way is up yet. Yeah. I like this one too, and I can I think I I might put some little tiny things down in. Yeah. This one would be fun. I could put this, you know. Oh, uh huh. I could, put, you know, or or uh, I have an ice skater. She could skate uh, right on top of the rock. Mm -hmm. Maybe we'll see. Um, this one is uh, water actually, but it's really kind of cool. So. Yeah, you'll find something fun to go on it. Uh huh. I could probably use this as a sun. That might be interesting, but we'll see. Um, then there's this guy's foot. <laughs> Don't know what I'm going to do with the guy's foot. Maybe I'll run over it with the motorcycle. Oh, there you go. Yeah, you know, who knows? I don't know. Maybe, maybe this bird will launch off of it. Let's see here. I can, the bird can just sit on his foot. I don't know, but we'll see. Um, there's this one, which is kind of weird uh, thing. Well, I liked what you did with the other one, like that. Yeah, I do. So. I I, I kind of liked it. So, and there's this mountain scene, and I just I really love this. It's just the right colors, but I just don't know what I'm doing with it yet. So we'll figure it out. But then there's this one where the squirrel is in the tree and he's watching the gingerbread men go in the house and they better run because the squirrel might eat them he so, might. so might the cardinal and i really like how this one came out with the extra little um border up there it was just a little too plain up there yeah but i like that one i i think this one's fun too yeah it is <laughs> Uh, uh, it's just like, okay, they're both got this such a, uh, um, bored attitude. And then there's this bright yellow flower. And of course we have the cat who is trapped and the bird is feeding him to the sharks. And then we have the chicken who has the fork standing on the guy's head. So love the gingerbread couple and town to keep. Yeah. I like that one too. So that's what I did. You can make me little again. But this would be a good sit in front of the TV project because, you know, once you got your backgrounds done, this is a small. This is a small thing to have on your lap. Yeah, it doesn't take up a, like, lots of space. And right. And you don't have to try to hold an open book. You could you could clip this to a um, I often when I'm working in my lap like at the computer or something um i use a oh what do they call those clipboard things yeah i actually have a big art one you know that's just big i i use a legal size one a lot because it's longer this way and, and so it'll sit in your um it will sit in your lap and lean against the table, but um, the other one I have is a big art one. It has a handle inside of it, that kind of thing, 
and um, but both of those work really well and you could clip this just clip it to the clipboard and then find your images and and you know because it's just something so little so yeah we love creating together too Cindy we just don't get yeah. to do it as much as we would like lately yeah and and with us going off it's going to be it'll be another while yeah um probably next thursday will be my last day i can stream that's kind I'm of gonna, what i figured i'm probably going to stream sunday but then the sunday after that i probably won't stream just simply because i'll have so much to get ready to go so but I hope you guys are having fun. Thank you all for Bye. coming. Thank we love you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.